Hi, I'm Dr. Ahmed Kamalasan, and you're watching the playlist header for Communication Systems. Communication Systems is an undergraduate course in most engineering disciplines, including electrical, electronics, uh, computer engineering, and telecommunications. Herein, we model transmitter and receiver pair. So the sender sends or transmits an information which propagates through a channel and then the receiver tries to acquire the information. So this pairing of transmitter and receiver, uh, this comes under the discipline of information theory and mathematics. So we would be looking into mathematical models of communication, uh, which would primarily include analog communication, but we would also introduce some aspects of digital communication. And of course, then we would proceed to the performance analysis of these models or systems. The prereq for communication systems is signals and systems. So I have another playlist where I have selected some of the lectures which are useful for communication systems. Uh, so if you want some refresher, maybe you can head to uh, this playlist. The textbook that I would be using is by Lottie and Ding and it is Modern Digital and Analog Communication Systems. Uh, this book has quite good mathematical workout of most of the schemes, for example, amp amplitude modulation and frequency modulation. And at the back end of each chapter, uh, we have some MATLAB based exercises that help us visualize the key concepts. Moreover, for practice and for exam preparation, we have the SHOMS series on signals and systems and therein you can find Fourier series and transforms and some aspects of modulation, sampling, uh, some fundamentals of digital communication. So you can uh, use some of the problems, solve problems on signals and systems which are replicated in communication system as well. So another book uh, which would be used in the reference setup is uh, by Simon Hyken and this is communication systems uh, the book by Leon Couch on digital and analog communication systems is also very helpful and uh, the book by Slahi and Prokis this gives the fundamentals of communications while the name suggests the fundamentals but some of the very involved concepts of communication and random processes and modeling is done in this book as well so the course learning outcomes, the first learning outcome is to be able to conduct analysis of baseband signals that is at low frequency in time domain and frequency domain. So this is an area that we have already covered in signals and system and we would be reviewing and doing some sort of extension. So next we have uh, the analysis of amplitude modulated signals in time and frequency domain. So this uh, relates to chapter four of the textbook. Next, we have uh, the interpretation of frequency modulated signals in time and frequency domains. So again, this links with chapter five of uh, the textbook, which deals with angle modulation and we have FM and PM therein. So next in the fourth learning outcome, we would be looking into digital communications and some fundamentals of that. So we would be looking into design aspects of quantizers under various constraints for the better understanding of the theoretical aspects i have integrated the lab work which includes simulation uh, for amplitude modulation and frequency modulation as well as uh, the demonstration on trainer boards within this playlist i hope you have a wonderful time and you enjoy learning